Today is day two of our 50 day challenge to learn generative AI in the easiest way possible. In today's episode, let's dive into six main types of generative AI that power everything from deep fakes to chat GPT to Sora. The very first type is GANs. GANs have two neural networks competing. A generator creates fake images from random noise while a discriminator tries to spot the fakes. They battle until the fakes become perfect. Think of it like a forger versus detective game where the forger eventually creates undetectable forgeries. That's exactly how deep fakes are made. The second type is VAEs. They are called the compression artists. VAEs, variational autoencoders, learn to compress images into simple number codes and decompress them back, like zipping files but smarter. They create a latent space where similar things are close together. Imagine all human faces compressed into coordinates on a map. Moving between points creates smooth transitions. That's how AI apps blend your face with a celebrity's face so smoothly. The third type is autoregressive models. They are the story predictors. These models predict one word at a time based on all the previous words. Imagine playing finish the sentence game. You say the cat sat on the and the model predicts the word mat. So the cat sat on the mat because it's seen this pattern millions of times. GPT was trained by hiding words in sentences and guessing them correctly trillions of times. It uses transformer architecture to remember earlier context. That's why ChatGPT can recall what you said 10 messages ago. Coming to the fourth type, the RNNs. RNNs process data sequentially with a memory loop, but they suffer from vanishing gradient problem, like forgetting page one where, when you're on page 100. LSTMs and GRUs fix this with gates that decide what to remember. The fifth type is transformers. They are the attention masters. Attention is all you need paper that we discussed in the previous video. That is what we're talking about. Transformers use exactly that methodology, which is called the self-attention to connect any word to any other word instantly. Imagine reading a book and instantly connecting all clues across the chapters. That's the attention mechanism with positional encoding and multi-head attention. So the final type in generative AI, the sixth type is reinforcement learning. Instead of learning from examples, it learns from rewards. The technique is called RLHF, reinforcement learning from human feedback. Humans rate outputs and the model learns from the preferences. It's like training the model on human output and model learns from their preferences. That's it for today's episode. Tomorrow, we are going to explore about multi-model AI where all these techniques combine. I hope to see you in the next episode.